Hey guys, Jason here. Welcome to the Crooked Mod. Um, if you guys don't know, I uh, I did watch uh, PewDiePie play through it, but I forgot where like all the keys and shit is and all that stuff. So I've also played through a little bit to see if uh, it's buggy. Um, so we'll see if uh, we'll see what happens. This game contains sudden surprises and harsh images. The weak of heart and those p those poor with horrors should not play. The author takes no responsibility for any trouble that arises from playing this game. I should just stop here. I hate horror games. There was a crooked man, and he walked a crooked mile. Oh, I should read slower. He found the crooked sixpence. Pence? What? Uh, upon a crooked style. He bought a crooked cat, which caught a crooked mouse. Damn! I love this music. And they all live together, in a crooked little house. Ah, it's a beautiful story. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Where'd the music go? I was listening to that. Phew, finally things are looking tidy in here. That should be that. Is there anything else we can help with, David? Nah, I'm fine. Sorry for making you guys help me move. Thanks for showing me the place, Paul. I'll have to pay you back sometime. Ooh, nice. The three of us could go drinking. I look forward to it already. Well, we'd better be we'd better get going. God, be careful, you two. Bye. Oh my god. Damn door is so loud. Okay, what do I do? A sink, okay. Stove. I can cook me some pizza. Refrigerator. TV. Crack in the wall. Tissues. A phone. The f what's this? What? Come here. Huh. Sheesh. Paul forgot his license. I should get it to him. I should get it to him if he's still around. It's three o'clock. All right. No, it's nine o'clock. Sorry. <laughs> you hear someone? What's with that place? Seriously, it's filthy and it's practically falling apart. What were you thinking? You wanted to move for a change of pace, and that will not help him. You hear? Look, what can I do? He's not the richest guy, you know. He can't even afford much furniture. Besides, he told me to look for the place, right? Don't come to complaining to me now. You're right. I'm sorry. I just wanted to help David out. I know. Look. I should be sorry. We'll visit some other time. The talking gets distant. I love how it was like all disfigured and formed and whatever. The license can wait, I guess. Better get to bed. Let's see, what do we got? Oh my, the damn doors are so fucking loud. The computer. I'll just sit down in this chair and I'll play some... I'll play some Crooked Man. Wash bin. Washing machine. Toilet. Can I sleep in the bathtub? Let me sleep in the bathtub. I'll sleep in the shower. Alright. Head down. SHUT UP! Oh, sorry, I mean, hello? Hello? Who is this? Sh Shirley? Oh, Shirley. Ooh, David. That bitch hung up on me. What the fuck? I'll just call it a day. Just take it easy for the f for my first day in the new place. D David, it's only nine o'clock. I mean, where the hell? Why are you going to bed at nine o'clock? Like, you you're a grown man, aren't you? Man, I'm tired.
Shut up, man. It's not cool to cry. There is no reason to cry. Oh, really? Is that somebody crying? I can't sleep through this. Is it one of my neighbors? I should go complain. The crying's making me sad. Tissues. Tissues. Wipe my wipe my tears away. Oh my god, it's a fucking face. <laughs> Shut up! <laughs> oh my god. It stopped! Okay, so I'll go back to sleep. About what? It fucking stopped, you retard. Not gonna get some response. Not gonna get some response. Yes, who is it at this hour? Pardon me, I'm just... It's just, I can hear from my room, even. It's making it hard to sleep. Would you stop? <laughs> huh? What you're saying? I was just... What you're saying? What you're saying? I was asleep until you woke me up? You tried to start something? You're the guy who moved into 205, right? There's no way you would hear me from there. Oh, I thought she was making noises. Er, I guess so. Sorry for waking you. Bye now. She said, Those are pretty far apart. More importantly, it was a man's voice. Was it to my imagination? Well, it must have been my imagination too, David, because I heard that. Whatever. I better get back to sleep. Alright. Sounds like a plan. Sounds like a plan, man. Can I go here? My apartment creeps me out. Can I go here? Nope. Alright. Shut up. Shut up. Oh my god, that's so fucking loud. Hmm. Under the bed. Is Paul trying to prank me? Talk about bad taste. I don't want to go see the boogeyman, David. I don't want to see him. Fine, I'll go back to bed. Under the bed, huh? What's down here? Okay. Ever since she went away, I spent every night clutching my pillow and writhing. What? Writing? Is that supposed? To I think that's writing. I don't know. I can't say goodbye. What other choice do I have? What's this? Did the former tenant leave this? Oh, whatever. I'll get to bed. Oh, shut up, man. Come on. Go to fucking sleep. <laughs> that sound still? Where is it coming from? Give me a fucking break. I need to sleep. <laughs> shut up! Hello? Uh, yeah. Thanks for all the... Don't cut me off. No. No, I didn't mean... Uh, just... I'm busy with work, so... Stop cutting me off! Yes, I'll come visit today. Tell her that for me. Okay, bye. Man, I slept until noon. No, you slept until nine. I'd better go. How much for taking it easy? Look, David. Dave, I I'm gonna show... Look at the clock. It's still freaking nine. You, you slept... Like, you haven't slept. Look, it's still dark outside. Look. Still dark still dark outside. Look. Still dark. Go back to sleep. Where am I going? Oh, hello, Paul. See you later, bitch. Paul's over there. What's he here for? I don't know. Do I look like I'm him? Do I look like I I'm... I'm just like, standing on the I like just skip the fucking stairs. Too badass for stairs. It's fine. Wait, don't we have the... Um... Oh yeah, we have false license. Okay. Paul, what is it? Uh, yeah. I forgot my license yesterday. Was it like on the table? <laughs> oh yeah, this. Sorry, I was gonna bring it to you, but... Whoa! Thanks! So, you going somewhere? Yep. To the hospital. <gasps> Is Shirley hurt? Is she hurt? 
I see. Take care of yourself, buddy. Oh yeah, Paul? Did you write something on the bathroom mirror? Huh, right on the mirror. What kind of childish brat do you take me for, David? S sorry, I didn't mean it like that. Anyway, I'm off. See you later, bitch! <laughs> Shut up, it's so- it's too damn loud. No, I can't stand you. Shut up, oh my- <laughs> What the fuck? Oh, mom. Hello, mom. Shut up, radio. I'm talking to my mommy here. Mom, it's been a while. Are you doing okay? Oh, no. If it isn't little Timmy, you're sitting in the ground. Good. You look Sorry. But I took a few days off, so I moved to this great room with furniture and everything. Radio, shut up! I'm trying to talk to my mommy here. It's near your favorite cake shop, too. So when you get better, we can live there together. Oh, that's wonderful. Get along with Linda, will you? All the fighting you do worries me so. Maybe I can come visit you sometime. You like apple pie, don't you? I'll make the best I know how. Aw, oh, that sounds delicious, Mom. Mom, I'm not Timmy. I'm your son, David. Remember? Oh, yes. They opened a bakery the other day. It smells so wonderful. Maybe I should buy from there. She's just doing her own little thing. It's nine. It's nine o'clock here still. What the f oh, by the way, that just said mom. Oh, who would you be? Why are you here? How did you get in? This is my room. Do you have the wrong room? Who are you? Say something, will you? Ma, ma. get out or I'll have you thrown out. Somebody, somebody, get a strange man of my room. Get rid of him now. Mrs. Hoover. Mrs. Hoover, don't strain yourself. Please, go to sleep, okay? Who are you? Don't touch me. Get away. Now calm down, miss. Let's get you into bed. I'm sorry, David. Leave your mother to us. You'll have to leave for today. I'd go fucking crazy too if the goddamn radio didn't shut up and it's just static. Understood. Take good care of her. Davy? Is that my Davy boy? Where are you going? Why are you leaving me? M Mom! Your flight school exams are coming up. You want to be a pilot, don't you? Your mother always has your back. Please, don't leave me alone. I don't want to be here. Alone. Davy, please. Mom! It's me. Remember? Mom! David, please leave. She's very confused right now. But, but she said my... I SAID LEAVE! Mr. <laughs> <laughs> Silver, please calm down. <laughs> what the fuck? Let me back in. <laughs> what the fuck just happened? <laughs> what happened? What the fuck? Oh, David, did you see your mother? Yeah. Though, I guess she still doesn't know me. Yes. She's forgotten many things. She's having trouble controlling her emotions. I ask you to be patient. She may... Well, get better, so you can live with her again. Thanks. I hope you can help her. What was that? TV, was that you? Shut up. Uh, must be in this room. Chair, what are you doing chilling with the, the wastebasket? Did I move that chair? Hmm, there's something in the drawer. Got a leaflet to the school. Looks pretty old. Hmm, these LM dot M dot courses are circled. Was someone shooting to be a lawyer? I guess this must be the former tenants. He sure forgot a bunch of stuff. Maybe no furniture is better after all, huh? Still nine o'clock, David. Oh my god, shut up! Hello? Hey David, how are you doing? 
<laughs> you saw me just yesterday. I'm doing fine, thanks. Good, good. If you call if you're ever lonely. Okay. Alright. By the way, I got a call from Shirley yesterday. We didn't really talk, but... Sorry, I told her your number. She said she was worried about you. It's okay. Tell her... I... Tell her I do oh, okay. <laughs> Tell her I don't need her to worry. She just she should just look out for herself. All right. Well, I'll hang up now. All right. See you. Mouse, get the fuck out of the picture. Mouse. Mouse. God. Fine. You can be in the picture. Nope. Just that bitch. Hey, look, T. Tired of reading. I should go to bed. You look like you were pretty intent on that reading there, David. Just got one book open, but, you know. Oh, shut up! Ah! Did it say sink? What was that? Oh. I feel bad for anyone who just heard that. Oh my god. Uh, that's a crooked man. There was a crooked man, and he walked a crooked mile. He found a crooked sex... Sex pants. He found a crooked sixpence against a crooked style. He bought a crooked cat, which got a crooked mouse. And they all lived together in a little crooked house. It's a beautiful rhyme. Isn't this a mother goose rhyme? Guess it... Why is it under the sink? I guess the previous tenant? This is so strange. I should get to sleep and forget about it. Alright guys, I'm gonna uh, end the episode here. Subscribe to join the awesome people today. Like for more of the Crooked Man. Remember to share with your friends so they can enjoy my pussiness in a fucking horror game. <laughs> and this isn't even supposed to be scary. Um, so, I'll see you guys next episode. Bye.